Hello and welcome. In this video we are going to learn how you can install Laravel 5.6 or any version of Laravel on Windows. Uh, for this course I am going to use Windows operating system. If you are using Mac or Linux everything is going to be almost the same. Uh, for, la for Windows user it is a little bit different but I will show you how you can get through them. So the installation suggests you that you must have PHP for 7.1.3 the SSL extension enable and PDU and all of these extensions here so I assume you have the basic knowledge because in the beginning of the video we discussed that you should know the basic of PHP that's why you must have VM server or any other uh, Linux distribution installed in your computer I'm going to use VM server in this course so I have VM server installed means I have Apache MySQL PHP uh, installed in my computer uh, and then we can install the Laravel like this first of all you should know that if you want to install Laravel you must have composer it is not like other framework like code igniter you just copy the source code and everything should work the easiest way is to use composer so composer you can go to getcomposer.org and download it I will download and go through the installation because it is very basic for the Windows user just install the exe one okay I have already one of them and again I will download it so let me go to the download and we have programs here is the composer once you run composer it will ask you to use the developer mode you feel free to uh, put it or do not put it because uh, it will give you the composer or an installer will be included uh, will not be included for this one because you are not using for the developer and you just use it to develop your application you you do need to check that secondly you come here and say you select the php 7 if you install web server in your system so you should select the php 5.1.9 here from the browse if it is not already selected you can find it here going to the c drive web server and here you go to the bin you have php and php the latest version you select the, the exe and then next then you continue it and then it will uh, finish everything for you and then you must have the composer so uh, because i have already in my computer i do need to install after that if you open cmd here if you write composer hyphen v it should it should uh, show you the current version of composer installed in your system as you can see i have version 1.6.3 so if it give you any error not come in not found something like that it means you don't have composer yet so you should install that after you install the composer then you are ready to install Laravel here is how you are going to install Laravel there is two way to install Laravel one is using composer just like this you can escape this part and you can come here you can copy this code and the, the, uh, the, the way you do it just open your command line and paste this code it will go to the packages dot, uh, dot org or something like that and then it will it will just create an application called block for you a Laravel 5.6 application it is very simple you copy this one for instance you just go to your desktop or anywhere in your system just right click and then open uh, PowerShell and then paste the code here once you paste the code press enter it will create a, a application called block and after the block you can just start writing you can just uh, change the block to anything you want like uh, game or something anything you make just give them a name it will install the application for you the other way to install it uh, that is an easy way that you should run the Laravel installer the Laravel installer would be like this you just run Laravel new block it will just create it for you for me because I have already the Laravel coming on my system it is working if you don't have Laravel in installer here is how you are going to do but uh, as you can read through the documentation they will not explain you the right way first of all run this command this is going to be general for all operating systems so I'll come here and paste the code here I'll right click copy it anywhere let me clean this here and then paste it then you press run it will just uh, install the laravel installer for you this is laravel installer it means using laravel command you can install it after doing that 
as you can see they have explained if you are using mac os do this one if you are using linux do this one but for windows they have nothing so i'll show you how you are going to use it for windows first of all let the, this uh, application uh, the comment run and finish after that i will show you how you are going to add the comment to your cmd or to the extension of cmd so that you can use the laravel new application name comment in your command line this is done now if you um, for you if you run laravel it should not work because it should give you an error but for me because i have already installed the laravel installer it, it gave me the installer version 2.0 so here is how you are going to do this one i have written an article here in the technic.com anytime you forget just come here and do the, these things as i said the documentation is not uh, very clear so they say that you should change the environment path just co copy this code here copy this one now run the cmd as administrator press shift and enter control shift and enter it should run the the powershell or the command line as administrator then copy the line here if you paste the line here and then press enter it should give you success specified value saved after that you will have access to the laravel command as you can see you can run laravel new anything just give the application name or app name without any space it will create the application for you and then you can develop your application like that so this is the uh, actually the easiest way to do because in the future also you do need to run this full command you just need to run the following command just laravel new your application name it will create the application and it will download all the files so i will come to the desktop and here i will create the application so let me just create the application uh, folder here inside the folder i will create the application i will give them uh, my apps inside my app i will just open the powershell here you press shift and right click it will give you the powershell here i will just say laravel new and then app anything you can give the name uh, let me give this a uh, car repair then you press enter it will start creating your application it will take a few minutes depending on the speed of your internet and it will install the, your laravel application on your system so in the next video we will continue our discussion thank you for watching